Vanessa and Daphne night. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? Just like like old school like pasta bolognese. Oh. You know, brown fat beef from Whole Foods. Okay. And then I have like tons of vegetables. I'm gonna do the model version with the zucchini, Ooh. pasta, noodle okay. stuff. Okay, all right. That's what we're gonna do. This lighting is so dramatic. I'm living for it. <laughs> it is fancy, baby. Can we discuss boys with No, we won't discuss boys. Daphne, <laughs> <laughs> you don't need to get so emotional. It's okay. Oh, wow. Half a red onion. Oh. oh. It's okay. Darling. <laughs> Being all passionate. Daphne, you have like the most po the poshest accent ever. It's like when you say darling, it's so oh, hilarious. Darling. Yeah. <laughs> so let's start with make doing our um, beef in the pan. Grass-fed, grass-fed, whatever. Nice. Organic butter. Okay. To use good ingredients. Yeah. Like for example, when you're in Italy and you eat bread or whatever. Yeah. It doesn't. It's not bad for you because it's, everything's local. If you look at Italian people or French people, they're not fat at all. So wait, you you spent some time in uh, Italy modeling, I guess. I have. Yes, yeah, I have. I spent. Uh, I mean, all, for the shows in Milan. Yeah. And then, but we would also go on holiday a lot. We always come to New York for work. Yeah. Um, but you want to come like. I don't know. I think it's you approach it in a different way if you can come here for fun. That's true. What's your favorite city you've been to for work? London. Yeah? <laughs> yeah, I really love it. Here they're much more, it's like very straight to the point, like, oh, I like this or I like that, or let's go out or let's do, you know? Yeah, but at the same time, also sometimes people uh, always want to be nice and whatever, so to get sometimes, something. yeah, they're not really, in Milan, they're like, no, it doesn't work. Yeah, that's As true. Here, they would always like, Make it like, oh, but me, you know, well, it's kind Maybe. of nice. But people in, in, in France or in Italy, in my opinion, are very, very even different. on shoots, sometimes I felt like, wow, we have a massive fight here. Yeah. Like the stylist and the photographer were like, once I was on a shoot and the photographer walked out for like 20 minutes, he went for what? like a walk. Yeah, because oh he God. disagreed with the stylist. Wow, okay. Yeah, and then afterwards he came back and he shot amazing pictures. It was like, <laughs> they needed to, That's you so know. normal there, yeah. Yeah, they just needed to, to, to sorry, get like, um, have their moment. Yeah, to have their moment and it kind of pushed both of them to... Actually, to I know what you mean, because over here it's all about being professional, so even if you're not happy, you don't show it. Exactly. Yeah. People yeah, hide, yeah. people are very good at hiding their feelings, and That's I true. think Thank people like burn out because of it. This is my beautiful meat. ground beef. Do you eat meat, Vanessa? I eat everything. Oh, amazing. That's why I have a bum. Daphne <laughs> loves like meat and fish yeah? way too much. What's your favorite dish? dish? Forever and like, ever? Like screw modeling. <laughs> screw modeling? Yeah. What would be your dream dish? I'm gonna mm -hmm. chop some uh, portobello mushrooms. See, I don't even know how long you've been modeling. What is it that you've been doing? Uh, full time, I've been doing it now for about uh, a bit over three years. Okay. And then uh, before I was in university, so I was like studying. But I love yeah. economics. I'm yeah. like, so interested in it. That's so cool. Yeah, so, I, and but when, when I was doing it, it was quite hard for me to travel at the same time. Yeah, so yeah, I would yeah, like model a bit in Paris or maybe. I would do, yeah, and then a bit in, in London. You know, it's easy, I can take the train. Yeah. But not so much. Um, like traveling around. Yeah, like. Oh, you discovered, girl. I got this discovered. <laughs> at a uh, festival, a music festival in Antwerp. 15, 16 or something. My parents were very strict about it, like they wouldn't really allow me to miss any school or to mm -hmm. do like a lot of modeling. I'm pretty sure like all girls say this, but yeah, yeah. my dad was very... Um, he wanted you, to, it was it because you, they wanted you to study? Yeah, they wanted me to study and also I'd say that maybe in, in, um, in Belgium especially, we don't really have big dreams like oh I want to be an actress or I mean you what? can have them as a, as a really? child like people have them but we don't really like big aspirations yeah we're, I think yeah. I guess we're we have a little bit like a tendency to be afraid of it to like afraid of the unknown I would so, never have thought that I'd never have known that either yeah so I guess wow. okay. I guess I mean my parents were very like just do the do the normal stuff. Just get a get a good degree in school. Yeah. Whatever. Like that was very important. Just do what the, what everyone else does. The yeah. normal thing. Yeah. Yeah. More more like go for something secure. Okay. You know, like yeah. everyone would say, like, oh, but what what are you gonna do if modeling doesn't work out, or oh, what are you gonna do if, if this or this, you know? Yeah. But what made you want to go do something different? Because that would have been really scary, right? It was really, really scary, scary but. I guess also because uh, my parents like didn't allow me to do modeling for such okay. a long time that I was waiting for it so much when I was in uni. Like 
I remember sitting in all those like all those courses and like studying for all my exams and whatever, and then knowing that okay, as soon as I get this, I can go for modeling. Yeah. Like it was it an extra you, yeah, it was an yeah, extra yeah. push for me. Modeling was also going really well for me, so I was like, all right. You know how it is. Like we're yeah, long. Yeah, yeah. We don't have tits. You don't feel <laughs> yeah. But you don't feel. Speak like, to yourself, honey. I have a push-up bra, which does me wonders. <laughs> if I'm gonna add the tomato straight away, it's gonna soak it. Yeah, it's gonna. Yeah, super soggy. Yeah, I like it spicy. <laughs> is that pepper? Is it? What it's is pepper. It? Himalayan salt. Oh. A little bit of hot sauce as well. Everyone tells me so many crazy stories about modeling in Asia. What is, What do you think? Is it better than in Europe or is it different? I did, I did a few uh, magazines there, yeah. Nice. I'm super tall. I don't yeah. really fit. So. Really? I would never be able to tell. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's, it's not that I'm, um, that I'm like, you know, I, I don't I, I don't look like the local people who, who live there, you know? Yeah, I don't really yeah, yeah. fit their clothes. And they like really, really young girls, don't they? They're yeah, like, yeah, like yeah. 15, 16 kind of But girls. I'd say like a magazine, like a Vogue or an Elle, like obviously they want to shoot like European brands as well. So then they mm -hmm. love, for those kind of jobs, they love uh, European girls that come there. Interesting. And um, so I would just spend a little time and then obviously you're super wanted because yeah. everyone wants everyone to, wants wants to, to be work with you. Basil, okay. I eat like 70% sauce and 30% because that's, that's what makes it good, right? Yeah, bang it on here. Like bang the lid of it. On yeah? That works. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like that, yeah. Maybe a heart. Boom! Yes. Muscles for not muscles. My, not my first time, darling. <laughs> you finesse in my kitchen and then... Trouble. Trouble. I trust you. It's have really good feeling. Yummy. Oh, okay. And then she stops saying that. Yeah, <laughs> always. Usually when I cook, I have a glass of red wine. And, uh, why does uh, that not surprise me? And, uh, uh, and some like nice music because cooking is like my dad always said it's like cooking is like sharing. So you should be like you and then me and then we have some music, we have a wine, and then it's like it relaxes you. You know, we're yeah. models. Like it's so basically it's uh, zucchini, um, which is like lighter than. Yeah, it's like set like almost like celery. It's like yeah, really low, like, yeah. Hard. I love how you said that, that. You're like, I would usually just do the real thing. Yeah. <laughs> but it's so true. Like if you have like model friends, you suddenly come up with healthy alternatives. Yeah. You're like, oh, I just realized like that we don't need to have burgers. We can have yeah. quinoa, flour. To be completely honest, if this was Belgium, like Antwerp, yeah, yeah. I would get the real deal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, no, no. Me too. Should we use these as well? <laughs> First, we take some water. So you don't have to cook these, right? No. Or do you? It says briefly steam or boil. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's do that. <laughs> Thank you, Vanessa. I have the brains in my kitchen. So I just take that, I bring that on travels, and then I have the, the one in the fridge. One yeah. well-prepared woman, my yeah. friend. I mean, How a model does it? No, it's like this situation. <laughs> Otherwise, I'm like pregnant, okay? It's like, no, well, I, I have this, especially when you travel it, you're like super... You get bloated. Yeah. And then they feel like flying all the time, you're like stressed out. It's yeah, like, yeah, yeah, just yeah. like hang. Yeah, and then this is the moment when you have a casting and then they're like, like bikini. Do you like have a bikini? Yes, yeah, try on these! And then it's like a crop top. Over yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, You're like, really? Yeah. You're giving me a crop top? Have yeah. you seen this? Can yeah. we crop this out? <laughs> Let me read the instructions. <laughs> that video is so funny. You're like, we need to cook this? Okay, uh, one second. Yeah, but I mean, I'm never, I'm usually not this much of a... Okay. Like model. This is why I like cooking pasta or whatever. Yes. It's fast, it's easy, people yeah. love it. Yeah, but yeah. I'm not gonna spend three hours in my yeah. kitchen and then make a bite that my guests are gonna be like, gone. Dancing. It's about the company and bringing yeah. people together and yeah. enjoying yeah. good food, but it should also like not be like on the shoulders of, you know, like the people hosting yeah. it that yeah, you're yeah, like, yeah. in the kitchen all day. I'm just gonna toss this in. Got all of the like chef talk. Yeah. <laughs> yeah just talking a little bit. Oh yes. Five so, minutes ago. Oh, do we have to cook this again? <laughs> So, You're like me though, it's all about the fluff. <laughs> just fluff it. Oh yeah baby, you just need to own it. Whatever it is, this is our model pasta right there. <laughs> We're gonna add a tiny bit of olive oil. Show us how you would make it. How you would want it. I would want it like, like this. Oh. Yeah, you see now, no one can see that the, actually <laughs> there was pasta and then you, And then yeah, like I said, normally I do it with parmigiano, but I kind of forgot frying it on the way home. But to be honest guys, it's... it's it's amazing. It still tastes delicious. Yeah, it's have some fresh basil. It looks pretty, no? Yeah, it looks well, very pretty. a little bit. 
The lady, like a lady in a tramp <laughs> moment here. Fair baby. What's gonna happen is we'll get it all over our face. Mm. And you know what's really nice as well is that you actually can taste every single little piece. And this also gives a lot of flavor. Yeah, to it. Did yeah, you yeah. yeah. I was not expecting that to taste the way it did. No, yeah, how did you thought? Good. How did you think? It I was thought it was really spicier. I'm not a spice fan, so when I see spice, I'm like, oh, it's uh -oh. gonna be spicy. Yeah. No, you can also add add a little bit of Tabasco, but if it's a little bit spicy for me, sometimes I even find that it brings out the flavor. Yeah, yeah, yeah I'll for sure. Sense? I have such a neutral palate, so I don't really eat spice. I love it when you say neutral palate. She has a neutral power. I've been on Google. <laughs> I've been on Pinterest. <laughs> I've been looking up <laughs> special terms to use so I sound How smart. do I sound smart? Because we don't eat meat that often, especially as, a, as models. Mm. But I can tell that at times I really crave meat. And also, do you like not feel like you meat. need it? Like, yeah. I feel, right? Like yeah. I get really tired, mm. I get low iron. Low energy. Yeah. Mm. The weather's changing, it was really warm, then it was like colder again. Buy like a roast chicken like from Whole Foods, like an organic one, mm. already made. You can ask them, you can tell them the oh, season yeah. you want and they make it fresh for you. So like take a little bit every single day, have some vegetables on the side, some whatever, whatever you have inside. It's actually really cheap. It's a good idea. This woman is full of good ideas. I'm uh, I'm moving in. <laughs> Married, you're bringing me good ideas yeah. and I'll cook. Mm. <laughs> and me while, while I'm eating. 